Don't like crowds? Couldn't get away? No worries, mate. We scour every booth to find the latest cool stuff for you. Here's what I found at the boat show. We're here at the Annapolis Boat Show with John from Colligo Marine. He has got a really innovative product that you have to see. So John, tell me about it. Hi Bob, this is our new line of Clego Duck standing rigging that we're really excited about. It's synthetic standing rigging, you can replace any wire on the boat today. It's one-fourth to one-sixth the weight of standing rigging, of wire standing rigging, one by 19 wire, which allows a higher riding moment, the boats can stay upright longer, you can have more sail area, and more importantly, you get rid of any pitching problems that you might have on your boat. Uh, the stretch characteristics size for size are the same as steel, which is the big enabler for this product. Uh, creep is low enough that we can design, for, design around it for any pretension that you have on any rig, uh, which is pretty remarkable. Uh, we're using lashing systems for tensioning or turn, traditional turnbuckle systems, so there's a lot of flexibility there. We've done boats from uh, beach cats on up to 70 footers, and we have capabilities of doing even larger boats. So we're very, very excited about the product. Uh, it's easily spliceable, easily inspectable. You can always see it. You can see when there's issues with it, and you can easily splice it to replace. Um, it's easy to carry around spares for, uh, for, for replacement and maintenance, things like that. Uh, one of the biggest things about it is uh, it's really, really tough stuff. It's been used in the commercial fishing industry for about seven years. Uh, the people on the Deadliest Catch use it for their crab hauler cranes. You know, I mean, it's just incredible. Pretty much they've done away with wire in the Bering Sea and they use this because of the toughness of it. So it's proven to be tough. It's not a soft rope that you're going to hold your mast up that somebody can take a machete and, and knock down your mast with. It's really, really tough stuff. In fact, the uh, hardest part about splicing it is you have to take a really sharp knife and saw through it to cut it. Um, so we're really, really excited about uh, our line of Caligo duck standing rigging. So tell me about these cute little goodies here. These are our line of luff line furlers, uh, code zeros, genikers. You can use them for stay sails on a, on a cutter rig, um, out on a bowsprit, you know, for a geniker or a code zero sail or in here for a stay sail. Um, they're really, really handy. It's, it's really the best way to handle a head sail. You have this sewn into the luff of the sail, and then the sail is ro rolled up on this luff. Um, and it's basically connected to a halyard up top through a swivel, and then you roll it up, drop it down, and throw it in the bag. To deploy it, you just connect it to the deck, connect it to the halyard, hoist it up, and deploy the, deploy the sail. One of the nice features is this continuous line here, so you never run out of line. We've all had issues where the, the sail and the furler rolls up too tight. With the drum, you run out of line a lot of times, and that causes issues. You've got to unroll it and re-roll it. This, you never have to do that. So it's, uh, we're really excited about our Code Zero furlers. So now you see why I said this is really innovative. It's so cool, we carry the little emergency shroud kit on our boat wherever we go. You want more information? Go to colligomarine.com.